Using the translations for the anthology was one of the most exciting but also difficult tasks. Um, often an editor would come up, uh, come with a new translation, bring us a new translation that would reveal a new dimension of a text. Teachers uh, suggested translations based on their classroom experience and we took all of this into account. Um, on the one hand, in a good translation, you want to give students the flavor of the original, to capture something about the rhythm uh, or the texture uh, of, of the original text. That's one of the excitements about reading world literature. At the same time, you want to make sure that these translations are readable. There's always something strange uh, about these texts of world literature for students, and that's good, but you also have to meet them halfway and choose translations that will be memorable to them, that will reveal the stories uh, and the drama of these texts, and ensure readability. Now, the great translations, of course, combine those two things. Fidelity to the original and readability are not opposed. They can be combined, and the great translations um, combine these two in one way, or, or another. Often with the great classics, there is an embarrassment of riches. This is a great age of translation in many ways, so we had many wonderful translations to choose from. In some cases, there are fewer translations to choose from. And sometimes you can't get the translation you want for practical reasons. But most often it was an embarrassment of riches, and we sat together and were weighing the advantages and disadvantages of different translation and trying to come up with that golden mean. So for example, for Homer, there, there are so many excellent translations on the market, new translations on the market right now. And we spend a lot of time sitting around and debating the advantages and disadvantages of them. And finally, we decided to come to use a new translation uh, by Lombardo, because the Lombardo translation is the most dramatic, the most fast-paced translation, the translation that captures the drama and the story of both the Iliad and the Odyssey. And with Homer, we, we felt that this is one, one of the anchors of the anthology, and we wanted to make sure that that story, the, the gripping nature of that story, would stay with the students, would stay in their memory, even after the course is over. And that's why we chose that translation.